title of the book is uh, Icon Brand Myth, The Calgary Stampede. It's the first collection of academic articles that are focused on the Calgary exhibition and stampede. The appeal of the stampede is that it offers something for everybody. If you want spectacle, you've got it. If you want performance, you've got it. If you want ritual, you've got it. If you want entertainment, you've got it. If you want education, you've got it. It's a multi-layered, multi-experienced event. And my heart is always happy at the rodeo. I want to be a real cowboy girl and wear all the buckles and straps and know oh, how it feels to wear spurs on my heels and just strut about in my shops. I want to talk Ironically, and people don't know this, a stampede was supposed to be a one-shot phenomenon, just a one-year deal. It was the vision of Guy Weedy, whom I think is probably the most underappreciated person in stampede history. Well, I think a chuck wagon race is a very controversial, but it's part of the mystique of that event. When you've got really fast horses, and when you've got big prize money, and when you've got very skilled drivers who are willing to take the risk for the extra yard, that combination is, it's a potential for accidents. And that when I saw it for the first time, I couldn't believe it, you know. And I saw them coming around that being so, oh, no, I couldn't believe there was gonna be something dreadful happening. <laughs> Just because it's Western and a bit, people think it's a bit, maybe people think it's a bit hokey, but no, 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 no. It's a world-class festival and it's got all the ingredients of festival. It spills out beyond the grounds into the streets. It has marvellous spectacles. It's got excellent performances. It's got aspects of celebration. And it's got powerful, ritualised performances. It's a world-class festival. And it stands with the best of them.